well today is just it's a it's a magnificently beautiful day outside and it's a good reflection of how I feel inside today right now which is just very shiny and excited about the release of Movement Matters which is a book on how movement how your personal movement can not only transform your physical body but also your community and the world Matters party, just bringing in you know food from anywhere. So we wanted food that was local. We wanted um, foraged food, food that was grown right here. These people here, they're like a walking. They're my walking timeline. It's really all the people who together all influenced me in some way that led to this moment here right now. So there are people that I love, um, people who are in my community who have enriched me and somehow and informed me, somehow people who I think are doing amazing things out in the world who are really there in the embodiment of some of the ideas in Movement Matters and so I'm really excited to connect some of them who've never met each other before because I feel like there will be growth just from this event alone, the seeds of connection. So. I'm ready to talk now. <laughs> yeah. How's your food? This is like a wedding. I'm actually not planning on eating at all. <laughs> it's just like circulating around. Be like, how's the food? I don't know, but the wine is fantastic. Um, so, I just wanted to introduce you all to each other. Everyone here is someone that has taught me something. That has shaped or pushed on my thoughts. So I just want to say thank you. Very rarely do I get to look people in the face and say thank you for gifting me your time or attention or anything else that you do with your lifetime that I'm able to partake in. So this is really a party to honor you. So I just want to say thank you. <laughs> Movement Matters is a book that I think I think it will change the world. I know it'll change the world because it changed me in writing it. The fundamental understanding is that movement used to be the commodity between a human and the earth. It was you, you spent your movement for what you needed. There was a direct exchange between your movement and what you took from the earth. And you couldn't let it get out of control because that was, that was the self-regulation as you had to do the work for it. But once work started to be performed by others and machinery, you were able to no longer move for the very things that you needed. And then we started needing another commodity. We use time as a commodity, meaning you don't want to swim and get that food and, and uh, I don't want to climb trees to get that food. So you swim and I'll climb and then we'll swap the fruits of our labor. So we were generalists but then we started to become more and more specialized in only the things that we were interested in doing. And then over time that interest got smaller and smaller and smaller and then we didn't really be interested in doing anything. And then meanwhile someone else is doing all of these movements kind of on our behalf. So that's what it's about. It's about how does my movement or lack thereof affect you and you and you and you and people that you don't see anywhere else and how does it affect the trees and um, yeah, that's Movement Matters.